exit rate is steady, exceeding projections. Good. The purity levels look consistent as well. From these mountains of scrap, we begin the journey of creating new steel. Bring the next load forward slowly. Copy that, moving into position now. Watch your left side, clear the conveyor. The depollution levels on this segment are optimal. Good, the next stage is clear for processing. The journey begins here, as mountains of shredded scrap are fed into the system, transforming waste into reusable steel. to lift, bring it up slowly now. Roger that, moving the load east, watch the left side. Once sorted, the metal bales are transported to the facility, ready for the transformation into new steel. Watch the flow rate right here. We're seeing too much plastic getting through. Noted. I'll flag it for the maintenance team. This is where the transformation truly begins. We monitor the mix closely to ensure the quality of the new rail steel. We need more agitation. Increasing the amplitude now. Monitor the lower discharge. It's clearing fast. This high-speed conveyor system utilizes magnetic forces to separate the valuable steel from other debris. The eddy current separator uses a rapidly changing magnetic field to induce a charge in non-ferrous metals, literally flinging them into a separate chute. The flow rate is optimized and the contamination sensors are clear across the board. Excellent. We are ready for transfer to the furnace. Control, the scrap feed is steady and entering the pre-sort tunnel. Tonnage looks good. From scrap to rail, the journey culminates as the purified fragments are fed into the furnace ready to be forged anew. Temperature is holding steady at 1500. Good, maintain the feed rate. This preheating phase is crucial, dramatically reducing the energy needed for the final melt and transforming the scrap.
the heart of the process, the electric arc furnace. Here, intense heat transforms recycled scrap into a sea of molten steel. This fiery river is the slag, a crucial byproduct in our sustainable steel production journey. The recycled steel is superheated and then forced through massive rolling stands, transforming the scrap into the precise profile of a railway track. The glowing steel passes through the final rolling stand, achieving the precise profile of a railway track. The continuous casting process transforms the recycled steel into a glowing, powerful new rail. Here in the rolling mill, the superheated track is rapidly cooled by precise jets of water and air, forging its final strength. The flying shear precisely cuts the molten steel, transforming scrap into the rails that will soon span the continent. After the intense heat of the furnace, the rails enter the specialized cooling area, a critical step in the transformation process. The green stripe signifies that this rail meets the highest standards for sustainable infrastructure. The final stage sees the newly formed rail marked for identification, completing its powerful transformation from scrap metal. The transformation is complete. What was once scrap metal is now high quality rail. From scrap metal to finished product, these rails are bundled with precision, ready for their new life on the tracks. Next, the steel undergoes specialized heat treatment, a critical step that ensures the strength and durability of the new railway tracks. The journey from scrap to rail requires intense heat. After the furnace, the tracks are quickly quenched to harden the steel. Utilizing precise induction technology, the recycled steel is superheated, ensuring the structural integrity of the new rail. Here, the recycled steel journey continues as the rails are superheated by the induction coils, a critical step for durability and quality. To ensure maximum durability, the newly formed railheads are rapidly cooled in this specialized quenching process.
here, the multi-axis milling machine precisely sculpts the recycled steel, transforming raw material into high-quality railway tracks. This automated process transforms scrap metal into precision railway tracks, minimizing waste and maximizing efficiency. After the wash, powerful air jets rapidly dry the newly recycled steel, preparing it for the next stage of manufacturing. Scan complete. The system confirms the rail has passed all quality checks. Under the careful guidance of the engineers, the finished rails are loaded onto the transport cradle. All bundles secured on cradle 5. The load is stable and ready for dispatch. In the final stage, our robotic systems efficiently wrap the recycled steel, protecting the rails from the elements before they are shipped out. From scrap metal to finished rail, this facility processes thousands of tons of steel every day, ready for installation across the country. Audio is dominated by the sounds of heavy industrial machinery. machinery. The loud, motorized... Easy now, center it right there. Looks good, set it down. Tension the chains on the left. Thumbs up from the rear. Confirmed secure. Send the crane back. Gates are secure. Track is clear. Bring it in. We're clear on this connection. All right, lock it in. Start tightening the bolts. Watch the crane swing, keep it steady. All right, lowering the tracks now. Guide it into the sleepers, easy now. From scrap metal to this flawless finish, the journey culminates in precision engineering. A testament. A testament to the circular economy. We transform yesterday's scrap into tomorrow's railways.